Hey everyone, hope you are having an awesome day. I have got something really cool to show you. X2 World Tech has been building some incredible apps on Caffeine AI. One of them is CSGO with spectator mode, smooth graphics and a new skybox coming soon. It's still in development but you can already see the potential. Check this out. This project is proof that Caffeine AI isn't limited to dashboards, apps, or civic tools. It can even power next generation gaming experiences that combine smooth performance with decentralized infrastructure. Games like this remind us how versatile Caffeine AI really is and how developers are exploring its boundaries in ways that go far beyond traditional blockchain use cases. Keep an eye on this project, it could evolve into something special. First up, there's a new proposal before the network nervous system that could change how everyone sees progress on Caffeine AI. The idea is simple but powerful. Diffinity and the Caffeine AI team would publish real-time metrics on applications being built with the platform. Now, why does this matter? Well, Caffeine AI led by Dominic Williams has been described as a tool that could support millions of apps by the end of this year alone. But until now, adoption updates have been scattered and mostly anecdotal. With this proposal, the ICP community could finally track progress directly using a publicly accessible dashboard that shows cumulative app numbers updated daily from verifiable backend systems. Imagine seeing the exact number of apps being deployed, watching trends evolve weekly or monthly, and having a clear view of how quickly the ecosystem is growing. It wouldn't just build trust within the ICP community. It would send a strong message to investors, developers, and even institutions that this ecosystem is delivering measurable results. Transparency like this would also help smaller teams promote their projects, validate adoption, and showcase momentum. And for a project like ICP that positions itself as the foundation of a self-writing internet, Real-time adoption metrics aren't just nice to have, they are essential for credibility. Proponents of the motion say this visibility could encourage collaboration and strengthen accountability across the board. If approved, it would align perfectly with Definity's promise of transparency and Dominic Williams' long-term vision of sustainable growth. It could even become one of the most symbolic milestones of ICT's journey so far. Now, speaking of visibility and connection, let's move on to a brand new mobile-first platform that brings the ICP community closer together. Built by Marcus B30 using Caffeine AI, this app lets users connect, share content, and engage entirely on-chain through the ICP blockchain. What's exciting is that it's based on Dominic Williams' long-standing idea of a hyper-local network for ICP users, and now it's finally here in a practical format. Here is how it works. You log in with internet identity, select your country from the ICP hub list, and choose a username. From there, you can get into a community feed that shows posts from your country. With just a tap, you can switch to a global feed and share everything from knowledge and updates to memes. Every post allows one vote per user. If a post gets too many downvotes, it disappears automatically. Meanwhile, both upvotes and downvotes earn you ICCP, which means Internet Computer Community Points, which serve as recognition for your engagement. The app also introduces hubs, which are like digital community centers. These hubs provide space for events, updates, and news, both locally and globally. There is even a dedicated Definity feed, ensuring everyone stays connected to official updates. The roadmap looks even more promising with upcoming features like notifications, safe contact sharing, user rankings, polls, better filters, multi-language support, and even tokenization to bring practical value. Desktop optimization is also on the way, making this more than just a mobile tool. This platform is already live, so anyone in the ICP community can start exploring it now. It's a refreshing reminder that blockchain isn't only about finance. It's about building real connections locally and globally. 
From community hubs to data insights, our third update is about the Zero to Hero dashboard, which is now live and yes, it's powered by Caffeine AI too. The ZTH dashboard is designed as a one-stop platform for tracking everything from crypto to metals and ETFs. For the ICP community, this means a more complete way to evaluate not just token performance, but also broader financial trends. One of its standout features is Coin Hero, which ranks the top 100 cryptocurrencies by market cap. It gives an alternative perspective compared to other trackers. But that's not all. The dashboard also includes comparisons between Bitcoin and altcoins, a fear and greed index specifically for ICP and detailed tokenomics combined with macroeconomic insights. In short, it's built for both accessibility and depth. Whether you are an investor wanting to monitor movements or an enthusiast curious about market shifts, the ZTH dashboard offers clarity in one place. And the fact that it was built with Caffeine AI shows again how AI and blockchain are merging to deliver practical, timely, and interactive tools. This dashboard is already public and open to everyone, giving the ICP community another powerful way to make informed decisions. Now let's head to San Francisco, where a developer named Amspeed has built something fascinating, a 3D map that shows newly issued parking tickets in real time. And yes, it's built with Caffeine AI and runs entirely on the ICP blockchain. At first, it might sound like a niche idea, but think about it. By visualizing enforcement patterns across the city, this app gives residents a new way to understand how parking is polished. You can explore hotspots, track trends, and even anticipate where enforcement is most active. The fact that it was developed in just a few prompts highlights how fast Caffeine AI can turn concepts into working applications. And because it's on the blockchain, the data remains transparent, secure, and tamper-proof. The app will be publicly accessible soon, and once it's live, residents and curious observers will have a practical tool that blends civic data with the decentralized infrastructure. It's a great example of how AI and blockchain can intersect to create value in everyday life, far beyond finance or speculation. Finally, let's talk about a big shift in tokens. DogMe, which was previously part of Dogfinity, has officially migrated to Phasma. The new token is already live on CoinGecko with web access expected soon. This transition is more than just a rebrand. The team behind Phasma Future has bigger ambitions, teasing upcoming initiatives that include NFTs, marketplaces, and even robotics projects. That's quite a diverse roadmap, and it's caught the attention of many in the community. The migration has already sparked noticeable price movements, and by joining CoinGecko, DocMe, now Fastma gets broader visibility among investors and enthusiasts. It marks another chapter in ICP's experimental journey, where projects continue to push boundaries, evolve identities, and explore ways to integrate digital assets into interactive experiences. The community is watching closely, eager to see whether Phasma lives up to the excitement its team is generating. So there you have it, real-time adoption metrics on the horizon, a mobile-first community platform already live, the Zero to Hero dashboard making market tracking simpler, Games like CSGO getting built with Caffeine AI, practical apps like San Francisco's parking ticket map, and tokens like DocMe transforming into Phasma. Each of these updates tells the same story. Caffeine AI isn't just hype. It's being used right now to create tools, platforms, and experiences that are shaping the internet computer. If you want to support our work and help us keep covering the most exciting stories in ICP, you can find donation details in the description below. And don't forget to check out the links we have shared for each project we discussed today. This is Ledger Life. Thank you for tuning in and I'll see you in the next one.